I am to the fans. Like, you know what I mean? I'm that sauce. I'm that bridge. You know what I mean? Is. I'm okay. that connect. Okay. So, okay. So, all right, we know you're from Brooklyn. Yeah. Love Brooklyn. Yeah, Brooklyn, yeah, yeah. stand up. Now, yeah, we ain't got to stand up. We ain't never sat down, down baby. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> okay. Mr. Brooke. There you all go. right, let me ask you, oh, oh, wait, real side question real quick. I know you was born in the East. Where in the East? Yeah, Van Sicklin Avenue. Van Sicklin? That's yeah, all you used to live? Oh, all right, holla, holla, holla. All right, there we go. Real gangsters in the house. I was like, ah, Brooklyn in the house. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me ask you a question. Let's talk about our love for Brooklyn a little bit. Okay. What do you think it is about Brooklyn that makes you rep it so hard? Because every single thing you're on, whether it's your YouTube, whether it's your MySpace, what, what, anything that I've heard you do, mm -hmm. you rep Brooklyn so super duper hard. So what I is mean, it that gets many, you so hyped? It's like a... How many places have had three world heavyweight champions? <laughs> the best basketball yeah, player yeah. that ever lived. Oh, like, <laughs> the best rappers. The best rappers that ever lived. Like, you know what I mean? Nah, it's, it's for real. Like, nah, nah, you I, ain't, I, I, I never heard of. No, nah, I, I never heard of the greatest basketball players being from Kentucky or not, no disrespect <laughs> or nothing like that. Just, <laughs> nah, I mean it's real. Like, yo, we, we've had a lot of we've had a lot of prominent people, whether it be sports, music. Any genre and whatever we come through, we, okay. we rule. You know what I mean? We right. hold shit down. So, you know what I mean? Shout out to every other borough, bro, borough. You know what I mean? But it's the Brook. You know what I mean? So, in your personal opinion, mm -hmm. what do you think it is about Brooklyn that just makes it so different from the other boroughs? Everybody got <coughs> their own little niche. You know, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna hate on any other borough. You know, they got their own thing that makes them pop yeah. up. But what do you think it is about BK that makes it so different? I think it starts off with just the greasiness. Yeah, the swag. <laughs> yeah, like, like, anyway, I don't know. Just Brooklyn just has a reputation. The minute you hear it, and it's like, I don't know, Brooklyn. I don't never want to go Well, so I, I actually hear another name called Crooklyn. Cro uh, oh, yeah. You know what I mean? That, that, that's, 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 that's from back that's in the day. That's from back in the days, like 90s, 2000, you know, 2000, how to survive. you know what I mean? That's how but I You know what's it. real, though? Talk to me. Whoever came up with the name Crooklyn, they wasn't from Brooklyn. Oh. It was from somewhere else. Okay, you there you mean? go. I mean, like, yeah, them crook dudes out there, man. I hear that. <laughs> okay, why not? So, uh, let, let me jump into uh, this question for you. I wanted to ask you, uh, so, what what actually, what makes your music so different from Mother Cats? And uh, uh, I, I just, I wanted to ask you that because, it, you know, this is actually... When I met Chino, you uh -huh. know, he hollered at me about you, and yeah. this is actually my first time, not tonight, but I, I heard your name, and he gave me your music, and, mm -hmm. and when I put it into rotation, I was like, yo, this cat is hot. Yeah. When, you, when, I, yo, when I got that, and I told him, too, I was like, yo, when you put that Brooklyn banger joint, yeah. that shit was cracked, my yeah, dude. Yeah, Enough respect look, on that, my, my dude. But Shout out to D Chambers and Matt Hoffa on that joint feature. Okay. But just the thing about my music, I just feel like I got a niche of just being real introspective. I, like, you know what I mean? I talk about me a lot on okay. my records, you know what I mean? I really want people to get to know me, you right. know? It's like, as far as, like, I've been through a lot of situations in my life, you know what I mean? A lot of people may have been to jail before, you know what I mean? I was caught up in foster care when I was young. I got snatched from my parents and shit like that. So, okay. you know what I mean? A lot of my music is heartfelt from thinking about the shit that I've been through in past situations, right. you know what I mean? So, gotcha. whoever's been through those situations, I want them to be, to feel like, yo, damn, I'm that dude that, you know what I mean? You ain't, you haven't been through this alone, you know what I mean? Right, 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 for sure. I hate so, that. the people out there that, that can speak for you, you know what I mean? That's what I'm here for. Okay, so, uh, how long you been rapping for? Wow. I, I've been I've been rapping like I've, I've been I've been rapping for a long time, man. But you know what I mean. I'm I'm in my mid twenties. Uh, the minute I seen Crush Groove, I went crazy. It was oh like yo, God. it was it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Wow. So you took it back to the eighties. So you've been actually out for a minute. You grew up nah, on hip hop. Nah, I, I grew up on hip hop. Like like I was a, when Crush Groove came out. I probably wasn't even. You know what I mean? But right. just like when I got a whiff of that, man, it was like, yo, damn, this little classic material. Yeah, why yeah, not? This, right? is, this is real. You know okay. what I mean? Okay. Okay. That's what's up. Well, you know what I want to talk about? Yeah. I know you had a mixtape prior, like before. I want to talk about still too many hustlers, not enough customers. <laughs> but I know that you had a mixtape before that. Yeah. That was like it's too called, many hustlers. It's called too many hustlers, not enough customers. So I like how you decided to like stick with that name too. So aside yeah. from where it came from, you mm -hmm. know, to let all our listeners know, mm -hmm. I also want to know what made you decide to stick with that. What when I first. When I first did that mixtape, I, I thought it was just so raw. Just the title alone got so many people's attention. They was like, yo, too many hustlers, not enough customers. I had people from out of state saying, yo, that's the realest saying I ever heard. Like, you know what I mean? Because it's just so you got relevant. me with the title. Yeah, it's, it's, just, <laughs> it's just so relevant to what's going on right now. You know what I mean? Like, a lot of people out here, they on their grizzly, they on their grind. But where are the fans at right now? You know what I mean? That's true. It's a lot of hustlers that's or whatever, true. but it's like, yo, damn, where are the people that are actually buying the music? You know what I yeah. mean? So yeah. I, I just, I, I seen, like, I just, it was kind of like an outlet. I seen it, and I was just like, yo, man. So when I decided to put out this next one, 
And me, Destro, and Norbs really went in and said, yo, listen, this is the one that we really going to go in on. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? I stuck with the title and just put it still too many hustlers, not enough customers, and just gave them that brand back again. Like, yo, come on, let's just get it popping. Is this a mixtape as well? It's more of a street album because it's more okay. original. It's, it's no freestyles on it. It's more original music. You know, when people hear me nowadays, I didn't, me and Destro kind of, and Norbs formulated this. We didn't want to be like, oh, uh, well, you know what I mean? To just come out and be like, yo, well, can he make a song? Can he do this? I didn't, I wanted to get, just get rid of all the questions right away. Right. You know what I mean? Just give them all songs, all formatted, give it to them, just be like, hey, yo, listen, feed, feast, it's good, it's good food, you know what I okay. mean?